What's up, guys? You guys know that I have always done, anytime I start a new show, anytime I bring up a new show on the channel, I always want to talk about what I think about it before I give it a full season review or some kind of review. Well, this is going to be my thoughts so far on the seven deadly sins. Now, again, I know that it's been out for a little while now, and I just want to talk about it for what my thoughts are about this as well as what what really got me into it because I was trying to look for another anime just to kind of pass the time and so far I'm enjoying Seven Deadly Sins. I'm on the first season as of right now. I have been introduced to of course Meliodas, uh, Deanne, King, uh, Bond as well as now also Gother. Now I will say that most of these characters, I know there's other characters that I'm going to be getting introduced to, I just don't know when, and I'm looking forward to it. I like the magic behind it, I like the night of the round table type of story, I like how it's got kind of a uh, Black Clover kind of vibe to it, if I'm not mistaken, so... I think that's probably the reason why I like it so much is because it's got a bunch of different things that I am enjoying from other animes that they are bringing into this anime. Now, <clears throat> I will say it is, it's got a lot of things I like in here. It's got where, of course, Meliodas, he's a very powerful, he's kind of a pervy, funny character. And then you got Bond, who is a smartass slash badass. And you got uh, King, who's kind of shy, but very powerful. You got Deanne, who is very, I would say, powerful and voluptuous, very outspoken. And I'm really, like I said, guys, I'm very much enjoying the series so far. Um, I know I'm not that far in, I, so hopefully no spoilers down in the comments. I don't want to be spoiled on anything. I still have a while to go. I think I'm very close to being at the end of Season 1 at the moment. Uh, but other than that, I'd say my favorite character as of right now is probably Bond. And the reason why I like Bond so much is because, I would say, because he's a smartass. He is very straightforward. He is like, oh, hey, you know, I want to do this. Or, you know, why, Captain? Why you want, you know, it's just, you never know what he's going to do, but he's also loyal and he's also very powerful. And, and I like his character. Like, looking at him, you would think he's a villain, right? Looking at him at first glance, you'd be like, oh, man, this guy's a villain. And it's like, no, nah, he's not a villain. He is portrayed almost as a villain in the story, but he's not. Just like all the other Seven Deadly Sins, like, they're not villains. They got set up for something that they didn't do, and I'm very intrigued to see the rest of the story. And with me talking more about these characters, I'm very looking forward into seeing how these other characters are going to be introduced and sh introduced and shown and everything. So I'm very happy that I got into Seven Daily Sins. I know I've had people tell me, hey, man, get into Seven Daily Sins or give it a try. It's very funny. It's this, it's that. And I've had several times where I have just shot it down. I'm like, nah, you know, I'm going to stick to, you know, Dragon Ball or whatever. And I'm actually more expanding into the anime world again because I went, I wanted to go back and just kind of just take a chance on different animes or different animes that's been out for a while that I have never given the proper chance or treatment or however you want to say it. Because I like the whole thing of these holy knights that they are supposedly the good guys, but they're not. They're very manipulative. They're very uh, untrustworthy. They're very power hungry. You never know what they're going to do. The powers that these characters have are very interesting not only from a magic standpoint but from like a demon standpoint to a fighting standpoint to a uh all kinds of things that you probably would not think would be in an anime because again if you have not given seven daily sins a try i highly recommend you do because I myself am just now getting into it, like I've been saying, and I don't regret it. I'm very much enjoying it. I think it's a great anime. I think it's very funny. It's got a lot of action. It's got a lot of thriller. Great characters. Great story. Great uh, character progression. I'm enjoying the hell out of it, and I can't not just <clears throat> and and, and empower that enough because of just... A lot of things that I think I like in anime, I like stuff that's comedy, I like stuff that's thriller, I like stuff that's action, adventure, drama, um, a lot of character progression. I like a lot of those things, and I also like how, because again, you know, me growing up on Dragon Ball, 
is a lot because I like characters that are kind of pervy. They're funny, you know. Got these girls, like, oh, I know, and then they're a badass. And then you got these other characters who's a very big of a smart ass, but a very big badass. And it just, I got a lot to learn in the world of the Seven Deadly Sins. You know, from the demons, I'm assuming, as well as the other magic that's in this uh, world, as well as also the other characters that are going to be part of the Seven Deadly Sins. So I'm very much looking forward to meeting these new characters and going forth, as well as seeing what other powers that our characters grow as further as I get into it. But I'll probably do a, I'll probably do a, uh, a story progression at some point of where i'm at probably because i know i've done that with one piece and i'm still watching one piece but i'm going to give you guys another uh part uh progress on where i'm at on that one but let me know what you guys thought about this i just want to do something a little different i'm kind of dive i'm like i said i'm diving really deep back into anime so let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments down below do you guys uh think that you know me getting a seven day sense was a great th a good thing or you guys watching if you're not go ahead and give it a shot like i stated either way let me know your thoughts are about this down in the comments down below hope you guys are enjoying your day hope you guys are enjoying your night wherever you're located also once again leave a like on the channel it helps me out helps the channel out also subscribe to the channel if you guys are new feel Feel free to ask me anything. Feel free to let's free let, let's feel free to talk about anything as well, anime wise, movies, TV, anything. So that way we can just have a great time and just talk about some great anime, great stories, great characters. So let me know what you guys think once again, and I'll be seeing you guys as always on the very next video.